a fitness kind of session now. Okay, so let me just explain what we're doing today, guys. We're actually doing this. What I'm going to do with this one, when I put it on, I'm going to actually add all the workout to the YouTube video. So I'm going to add that to the YouTube. So whoever follows this, whoever's following this in record, will be able to go through the exercises at the bottom of the video. Well, in the description part of the video. So that is all going to be in that. Okay? There is a structure to it. So the point is this with these workouts. We work, we warm up properly, prevent injury. We stretch. We then practice the particular work we're going to do with that kata. In this occasion, it's jumps. Okay? Don't, if it's too much, we can just change those squats for some of you guys, okay? I'll tell you what you're doing, and you can do a different version, but it is actually jumps, this one. Then we're working on the katas, particular katas. Uh, that should take 10 minutes, okay? Higher grade katas would take longer, 10 to 15. You will break it down and work on combinations three to five times, three times for this for this session. And then we'll do the core and abs session, uh, the abs se uh, exercises that we'll warm down like we usually do. All right? So, as I said, if you're watching this on record, you will see the workout printed in the description. Okay, guys? This is something I am now putting out there daily. Okay, so I'm, I'm sending daily workouts out there now. Uh, for people who want to train for kata. But, but the point is this, kata is the main aspect. That's when we are warm, and then when we do the, the, the workout, when we do the actual kata part, you're warm and you're, you're able to do it speed and power. Okay, building up the speed and power and working it through. Um, so for each cat, so you're going to pick a cat, think of a cat you're going to work on while we get going. Yeah, guys? All right. Hello, Sue. Hello, Charlie and Ollie Westcott and Ollie um, Hill. Ollie Hill. Thanks for joining us. Let's get going. Jog on the spot. This is going to be a similar warm-up to the other sessions, but we will work it out after that, as mentioned, for the catas. So don't require a gi today. You are fine without a gi, but you are also fine with a gi. So don't worry about that. Okay, jog on the spot. Okay. Brilliant. From side to side, side to side. Touch your heels. Knees up. Okay, good. And back to jog on the spot. Side to side. Knees up. Start jump. Knees up. 
Good. Okay, got job on the spot. Side side. At your heels. Knees up. Slow jump. Jog on the spot. Keep jogging, guys. Yeah. Okay, you can see it's better now than that one. So it's still in. Knees up. Yes. Do that once more last time. Okay, guys, once more. Jog on the spot. So it's five times. Side to side. Set your heels. Knees up. Start up. Okay, guys. Good. Okay, great. We're going to stretch it out now. So, circle the arms forward, nice and big. Backwards, nice and big. Okay, open chest. Okay, got a sumo stance, sumo stance. Push the knees out. Change to your left, push the hip forward. Feel the stretch here. Change opposite way. Change, okay, squat. Up now, push your knees out. Okay, forward, stretch, stretch up legs. Right, come back, stretch your arms. Okay, I'll oh, chip back downwards. Shoulders up. Okay. Push downward facing dog. Stretch. Walk forward, stretch hamstrings. Feel a stretch on those hamstrings. Roll up. Okay, stretch. Okay, shoulders nice, warm, warming joints up there. Tricep. Change. 
change opposite. Um, so I'm going to change. Okay, chest stretch. Now, guys, the first, the first exercise is just a basic jump. Okay, this is working and building up to the jumps that you do in kata. Okay, so the first one is from this position, you just chunk, tuck jumping with one leg. Okay, so you're going to do this three to five times, guys. Okay, but as you land, land with both feet. So it's Basically, a tuck jump with one leg, land both feet. If you have problems with your the area you're training in, please be very careful that your training area allows this. If not, okay, just do it very gently. Okay, very gently, maybe slower, maybe not such a high jump. Okay, guys? So let's just do three to five of those. Great. Great. Next one is basically a tough jump. Okay, five to ten, it should be not five, three to five, five to ten. My apologies. So if you can do ten, do ten, otherwise five minimum. Tough jump. So now you just just basically tuck jumping, okay? Now doesn't have to be fast. Just ten of those, five to ten of those. Go. Now, if you want to touch them in that way, in an arc kind of way, fine. Okay. All right, now we're going to do the turn 180 degree. So tuck jump, step tuck jump, both knees up, turn 180 degrees land like this. Okay, so facing the exact opposite way. When you land, aim to land without swaying or losing balance. Okay, guys, so five to ten of them. Okay, all. Careful out there. All right, great. Now it's just a landing, it's the landing of a jump. Now, for you, Ollie, you want to land your jump like this, because this is Yang Dan you're working on. Imagine you're in this position, land it like this, okay? Watch, everyone else. You can do that one as well if you want. Okay, that's the landing of Golan. Otherwise, the land with
Okay, you're landing a high grade cut. You know, you don't have to jump for this one. You just you just drop. Okay, you just drop. Go down. It's difficult to land without jumping up. So you have to jump up for that one. Okay, but we're talking about this landing for most cutters. Okay. So that's what you're doing. Okay, five to ten. Now all cutters land, as far as I know, with right leg in front. However, you can swap the legs if you want and do a landing with the left leg in front. Okay. Some styles you might have a landing with the left leg in front, not in shot down. When you land, feet same time hands. Don't hit the floor hard, just to for balance. Okay. Okay, this time you're going to jump into the last one, guys, on the jumping exercises. So you're going to jump, okay? You're going to do the jump as a tuck jump and land as the cat's a three. So if you have a look at this, then make sure all around you is clear. Tuck jump, land as in the cutter, okay? Five to ten, five to ten of those. And again, you don't have to do them fast, one, two, three, four, five. Just take a little moment in between each. Check your surroundings. Okay, so when you've done five to ten of them, when you feel your legs are bad enough, stop. Have a drink. Next is the cutter. All right. Get yourselves a drink when you've done that. We're going to move on to the cutter. Now, first one do Yan Sam down. Okay, guys, turn on set. Right guys, so the next thing on the list is the cutter. We're working on, so okay, the first thing you're going to do is yan sandan everyone, okay? That's the particular cut that you will do all the way through for this session. All right, no breaking that down. Then you're going to choose the cutter you're working on. So for instance, basadai, work on each combination, all right? And that should take about 10 to 15 minutes. 
Okay, so Hian Sandan is the kata you're going to do all the way through first, and then we'll explain that again. All right. Okay, room, if room does not allow, just do Hian Sandan in little combinations as well, but only once. Okay. Hian Sandan. Okay. Oops. All right, so so now you're going to pick the cat you're going to do and you're going to break it up. You're going to do each combination three to five times, okay, from slow to fast, okay? I will be doing it three times, guys, because I'm going to do pretty long cat up, okay? So, okay, I will be working with Basai Dai. Tutorial version. Okay. Any questions on that part? Okay. Each combination should have about maximum 10 moves per combination. Work it three times, then move on to the next one. Any order you like, and as long as you do the whole cutter. Okay. So, must I die? Okay, everyone. Good. free to grab a, a sip, a drink, okay, between all of that. I want you to think about all the kata stances, the stances you're working through. Look at the feet, are they right? Okay, you lose balance, redo it. 
don't just do each combination without thinking. You need to bring in the mind as well. You need to bring in consciousness, check the kata throughout. That's what you're trying to do. You're perfecting your kata, guys, okay? And your stances and everything that goes with it. Any questions you've got, guys, speak, just let me know.
All right. All right. We've got about five minutes, guys. Okay, five minutes to complete. All right, how are we doing? All right, good. So you should be feeling it now, guys, okay? If you're not, you haven't done it properly. Three times, slow at least, half speed at least, and at least one full speed and power. Five, you can do as well, okay? That takes a longer time. We'd probably take another, 10 minutes to do that. Okay, maybe even longer. So good session of kata would do that, take longer. So if you've done that, next part will be the abs. So we're working on the ab. Um, okay, so it's 30. Okay, no rush, but when you're ready, 30 reverse sit-ups. 
30 alternating leg raises, 30 Russian twists, and sit, knees to elbows, sit ups. Okay, so that means basically bring up your body and your knees at the same time, sit up. And the bridge on the floor, lift your bottom off the floor straight up. Okay, but I'm going to be doing them as well. So if you're not sure, watch me. All right, guys, so 30 reverse sit ups. Squeeze the abs. Okay. Alternating leg raises, 20, 10 each leg, okay guys? Go. Okay, you want to do more than 20, that might be a little bit too easy. Feel free to go on a few more. Next one is Russian twists, okay guys? I'd say if you've got a weight of some sort, okay, a bottle of water, whatever. Large bottle of water, medicine bowl, do it with the medicine bowl. 30. Squeeze the out. Okay, 30. 30 knees to elbows, okay? So when you're ready, 30 knees to elbows, okay? Twenty. Okay, great. And the last one is bridge. Ten bridge. Ten bridges. That's this one, guys. Okay. Okay, so that's, that's more or less everything guys on that workout and then we're going to warm down now, stretch down like we usually do. So you all all right? You finishing off, carry on. How are you feeling? Ollie, how are you finding? 
Did that work you out, Ollie? Yeah. I don't think Masha gets to do the rush, just get up to the Russian twist. I beat the Russian twist, but <laughs> finish off if you want. Otherwise, don't worry. It's quite hard. That's why it's brown and black belt team. It's not. It's not an easy workout, even though it's quite short. All right. It's not an easy workout. That's the point. Um, where are we? Thirty-one, thirty-one. So yeah, that, that's why it is advanced and um, it's aimed at people that really work on long cutters because then, look, put it this way, if you break down Hyanidan, how many combinations you got? What, three maximum, you know? Uh, you know, an uh, advanced cutter is 50 plus moves. So when you're breaking those down, you're doing at least 10, you know, 10 moves and times that by about five to six combinations. Some of them are more, okay? That's why it's more of a, so there we go. All right, guys, let's stretch it out. Are you all right? So if you manage to do all those properly, well done. You will feel it in your legs as well. And again, these are not, these, this workout and the workouts that we're putting out, uh, I'm putting out, not aimed to be done, they're not for once a week training. They're, they're for ideally once a day, with obviously having rest days. Etc. This is daily training routines. This, this is. Excuse okay. the hysterical laughter. What's that, Sue? I said, excuse the hysterical laughter. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's stretch it out. Uh, we're finished, guys. We're finished then. And as I always preach, I preach this every workout like that finishes with a good stretch, okay? If you don't finish every workout like this, do as many, do it for as many workouts as you can. Okay? Three, four times a week at least. Okay, stretch forward. Toes up. Feel a stretch all the way down. Down the leg and groin. To your left. To your right. Good, stretch forward, nice. Now if you can, revolve left hand on right leg and look through. Change. Revolve. Great, stretch forward. <coughs> Stretch forward now. Eating. Hamstring stretch. Stretch forward. Feet together. Just try and name all these. Okay, so we've done the is the found angle pose, apparently, found angle pose. Good change. Let's get the names. Okay. And this is the half over the fish's stretch. 
What a strange name for this, isn't it? I call it the torso twist. Twist your top half and your head. And change other side. Oh, your recons. Is that the dog? Is it? Yeah, sorry, just been charging downstairs. It's all right. Low lunge pose. Feel a stretch, especially there. Is what you want? And change legs. So we're on upward facing dog. Come back, extended puppy pose stretch. So you go right back on your feet is what I, I do. You don't have to, but you can stretch that far. Okay. Reclining now, reclining hero pose again. Don't go this far unless you know you can. Okay, now. As you lay down now, one leg up and twist one arm here, opposite side. Twist. Change. Opposite leg. Supported shoulder pose. If you can, if you can't, just do this one's pull tight hold. Otherwise, and plow pose. Next few quite hard as well. Okay, so it's the garland pose. You can move that as far as you can. Crane pose if you can. Great. Cow pose. Cow. Is that for the cow? Cow face pose. Cow face pose, but we missed it, so we're doing that as well. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. Someone laughing or crying? You're crying. I've got a dog attacking me. 
I'm here. Oh, I'd love to see that. Hold on, dog. Get her, get her. Show yourself, show your self-defense uh, talents now, Sue. <laughs> Block and counter. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm trying to see. I need my glasses. Um, okay, on your front. Arch downwards back. Nearly there, nearly there. Arch upwards back, cat pose. And. Straighten the legs, downward facing, walk forward, hamstrings. <laughs> That's enough. Enough, Bobby. Stop. Enough. <laughs> hamstrings. Roll up slowly. No, horrible. Stop it. Duck Stop it. Up. No, squeeze the scapula. Okay. Look down, look up. Side to side. You don't want to be dogging karate. Head to your left, look left and right. Sit. You want to stretch your triceps as well. Change. Well done, guys. That's that done. If you train properly, you'll be feeling it now. Well done, guys. All right. Well done. Great. Quiet one today, but well done for joining us. Thank you. That